Visitors to Carabelle delight at the view from the top of the Crooked River Lighthouse. There is simply no better place to see Dog Island, Eastern St. George, the mouth of Crooked River, and St. George Sound all from one vantage point. Plus, you can absorb a bit of seafaring history. The waters below you are some of the most historic and treacherous in the world. Native Americans were the first to sail them using dugout canoes, and the remains of their shell middens and mounds can still be seen around Carabelle. Panfio de Narvaez, the Spanish conquistador, explored and fled Florida in 1528, sailing his tiny flotilla of makeshift vessels out through these passages. Only four of his 300 men survived. Soldiers, sailors, explorers, settlers, pirates, and missionaries followed, including the notorious adventurer William Augustus Bowles. He wrecked aboard a British ship within view of today's lighthouse in 1799. The United States tried to make navigation safer by building a lighthouse on Dog Island in 1839, but it was toppled by beach erosion in 1872. For 23 years, ships coming to and from the mouth of the river relied on channel markers and the wits of their pilots for navigation. Then, construction started on today's lighthouse. Funded by the United States Congress, the Crooked River Lighthouse entered service on October 28, 1895. The location on the mainland also allowed ships of the lumber trade, then booming in the area, to use the lighthouse as a rear range light for the Dog Island Channel. The lighthouse functioned on oil until it was electrified in 1933. Keepers maintained it until 1952 when it was automated. Modern navigation improvements rendered it obsolete by 1995 when it was decommissioned by the U.S. Coast Guard, which planned to auction off the tower. Local citizens, however, formed the Carabelle Lighthouse Association. Working alongside the city of Carabelle, they succeeded in saving the light, which is listed on the National Register of Historic Places. Its beacon was restored and once again serves as a navigational aid to local vessels, and the tower is open for visitors to climb. Learn more about the lighthouse, including visiting hours and prices at CrookedRiverLighthouse.com. Plus, you can learn about other great places to visit at TwoEggTV.com. In Carabelle, Florida, I'm Dale Cox for Two Egg TV.